Okay, my sweet goats, I asked you to roast me on Twitter. You got- Dude, what the fuck, man? You are literally the worst piece of shit human being ever. You don't what? fucking upload your shit on YouTube ever. This video's been here for a fucking month, just sitting on it. I was for taking what? Time. You're taking your time? For what? Yeah. You guys roasted me, and you guys did it good. Okay? Uh. You guys fucked me up, okay? So let's get right into them. It's, uh, we got the first one here by Aiden Walker. Uh, he's a, he's, he's a good guy. He's a good guy. You should check out his videos. They're great. They're real good. Uh, he says, I hope your first child is stillborn. He's a shit guy. He's a shit guy. Fuck this guy, okay? Don't check out his channel. Fuck him. He's a rat. Drew Gooden. Nah, I know this guy's for sure. Nice guy. I've, I met him at VidCon. Really, really good kid. He's a good kid. He says, more like Bunty Queen. Ha. <laughs> Hashtag LMAO. Drew Gooden's also a shit guy. He's made my shit list. Fuck this guy. Then we got uh, then we got Ricky Berwick. You're a fucking shithead, Bunty King. You know, I'd rather have shit in my head than shit in between my teeth like you do all the time, you fucking disgusting gremlin. Get out of my life. Deodor Anthony, the, the most prolific YouTuber on YouTube. Not. He says that you made a whole video about stinkies, but we all know you were just projecting. I wasn't projecting, by the way. I smell fucking good, you disgusting piece of deodorant. No, you're you're a fucking Walmart quality quality deodorant, man. You're off-brand deodorant, bro. You're the deodorant that poor people get, okay? Because they can't afford that old spice richness. That's what you are. You're shit deodorant. Vanguard here with a fucking premium roast. Holy shit, I don't know how I'm gonna recover from this one. You're an extra DLC skin for Keemstar, added for diversity reasons. You know that'd be really fucking funny if a game studio did that? If they, like, if they, if they, uh, you know, licensed Keemstar's likeness, and then they added a DLC that's just me for him? That, that'd be fucked up. That'd be really fucked up, but I could see it happening, honestly. <laughs> you win with that one. Uh, Leon Lush says, you don't even shampoo your pubes, fucking tool. That's because I, I, I trim my pubes, bro. And I wash them with regular soap. And I'm a, let's just face it, I'm a guy, so the right, the soap that I use to wash my hair is the same soap that I use to wash my pubes, so there we go. There we go, now you know. Now you fucking know, okay? Grande. Fucking grande. Your tweets were higher quality when you were suspended. Thanks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, grande. Sunken-eyed fuckboy haircut, loud as fuck, laugh motherfucker, wears only three shirts, most of which only consist of, the, of Garfield, the bright fucking orange lasagna cat, Foot fetish, rotund rat looking ass, whipped. <laughs> uh, Linnea the Cake coming here with, you look like you'd fuck a goat with your bros, no offense. You just said something super offensive, followed by no offense, which made it more offensive, all right? Fuck you, lady, all right? You're a rat. I love your, your boyfriend is nice. Sweet boy, okay? But you're a rat, lady. You're a fucking rat. My friend Cookie, he says, your face is beautiful and I like it a lot. Thank you so much. That's... I had to read some- I had to read some of the nicer ones because you guys are real fucking mean. ISIS called, they want their bomber back. <laughs> you smell like food, lol. <laughs> what kind of food? The bad food? Do I smell like McDonald's? Do I smell like Chinese food? Do I smell like Indian food? What kind of food do I smell like, alright? What, what do I smell like? You always laugh at your own jokes because you know that no one else will laugh. Actually, I know that at least one other person is gonna laugh, okay? Okay? A bunch of fats. People calling me fat. A lot of people calling me fat. A lot of fat Indians. It's crazy. Why are you guys calling me fat? Okay, I'm not that fat, you fucks. Hearing you speak makes me want to tie myself to four semi-trucks and have them all drive at once. Then do it, okay? But make sure you get it on Lively, because my producer wants to see that shit. Bunty, the only 30-year-old who has the eye sockets of a 7-year-old. Fuck you, man. I just got- I got that shit from my dad. My dad has that. He's had it all his life. Can't deal- I just- Fuck you, okay? Fuck you. <laughs> Is that a beard or did you attach a dead rat to your face? Actually, it's your mother's pubes. She's been mailing them to me for years. And I was like, why the fuck she's still mailing them to me? It's really annoying. But I was like, you know what? I'm gonna make a beard out of it. And that's what it'll- that's what it'll be. So, you want me- you want this thing gone? Just tell your mom to stop mailing me pubes, okay? Ian Malshawn calling me fat. Fat, really? You're fat, Ian. You're the fatty out of the both of us. Everyone will be able to say that you are fatter than me, okay? Get out of here. You look like an actual anus. Thanks, Ramir. <laughs> Thank you. And I guess that's it, you know, there was over- there was like- There was a lot of submissions, but those are the best ones. I wanted to keep this video, you know, a relatively decent length. Nothing too fucking crazy, you know? Uh, thanks for submitting to that. A, a lot of them were really, really funny. Uh, some of them were kind of just downright rude. 
and uh, and uh, from, made from people who clearly don't follow me, don't know what I'm about, you know, they don't know what I'm about, but they want to go ahead and put their two cents in. But then again, I did ask for it. Some people who were very self, very, very, you know, not really very well aware of what they themselves, they, they kind of looked ugly themselves, calling me ugly. That's kind of weird. You know, I always find that weird when an ugly person calls me ugly, you know, but uh, it's, it is what it is. I guess beauty is in the eye of the beholder. And of course, they probably look in the mirror and they think, oh, what a beautiful person. And that's great. But uh, yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. I really appreciated, uh, appreciated you watching this. If you did enjoy it, hit the like, hit that sub button. Make sure you get notified by hitting that bell icon. And of course, if you really want to go, go the extra mile, consider becoming a patron for as little as a dollar a month. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. Bye-bye.